Hey everyone, I'm with Baby. I, to be honest, I've been like itching to like just like talk to the camera. I've just, I just want to create something. I just want to do something. And I just walked to my room and I'm like, you know, I'm going to like redo all my room. I just like moved all these books, stuff yesterday. I love like moving stuff around. I uh, really do. Um, but I guess I kind of want to see the before and after. This, this, I grew up, I actually grew up in this room. It looks like completely different, but when I was like 10 or something, I, when my brother went to college, my sisters, they wanted to change rooms. And then, so I kind of got forced to change a room. And so this has been my room since like, Griffin went to college, which was like 2010. I don't know, I was like 10. I was born in 2000. But my mom like had redone it. Like it did not have these cabinets before. It was not like black and white. It was like pink and green for a long time and I had um, like these parts. My mom like made it like some Paris type of theme. There's like American in Paris movie poster. There was another movie poster. The Elvis part of black and white. My dad loved Elvis. Um, and I guess this goes with black and white. That's me and my mom. Cringe is a whole little story. It's not that cringe. I've actually, I've learned to love it. Look okay, at baby. Okay, but um, I want to move all this. I got these steps. I guess I'll just put it out. like that and organize everything this is what this closet looks like there's so many clothes that I don't like I don't wear I don't know let me just update you next time when I do something. Um, this is what I got so far. I put some stuff in there, but I'm gonna take a break and go get pizza. Y'all, do you see that sun first of all? Uh, I wanted to. Oh, I got some sticky stuff on me. I was just outside, hanging from a tree, but um. I started to point the camera outside and then there's people out there. That's why I was looking into the sun when I was <laughs> outside. I'm like walking closer and closer towards it. And then I see my neighbors, like the older woman that lives there, like staring at me. I'm like, she probably thought I was staring at her. I'm like, I don't know what she thought, but um, love is blind. Have you all seen that show? Ugh. I'm on episode two of season six. I've seen some seasons before. Um, I'm so glad I'm watching it right now. But it, it, I love love. I like reality shows. Always have been because um, honestly, that's it. Probably has helped um, a lot of my like social stuff, like understanding people. Probably really has. Um, I turned off the autofocus. If you've been watching me, remember how it would go like chee 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 It's kind of stopped doing that, but now I don't know if I'm in focus. I got some sticky sap on me. I gotta wash that off later. Um, yeah, so, uh, love, I think, is blind. Like, true love is blind. Cause then, cause you know when you meet people and you like right away feel something or like, I mean like that's like true love. Well, I don't know if what I just said made, I agree with that or if it makes sense, but it, there's something, I mean, I think like marriage is completely 
different and like separate and dating is like different like depends what you want in that but like love is beyond what the physical looks like because that comes in with like judgment and the ego I know this was about a uh, cleaning I mean I can update it I we'll probably get you around to it eventually but um I don't know, I kinda wanna keep watching Love is Blind, so I'll update you later. Ooh. Yeah. So cold. You can put my. I like it. Josie, I love you. Uh, so, can I have something? Yeah.